Houston Texans make a splash trade. What is going on everybody? Welcome back to a brand new episode of The Lead. Your host as always, Harley Dugan. The Houston Texans made a huge trade today where it felt like a no-brainer, slam dunk, rock and roll, touchdown Texans kind of a deal in Shaq Mason now being the newest right guard for the Houston Texans. Shaq Mason is a former Patriot. Yes, New England ties. Before y'all go crazy about the New England ties term, this guy is actually really good, okay? And this is a massive upgrade for your right guard position. A massive, massive upgrade. I am very happy. We should all be nodding our heads in agreement because we are very happy about Shaq Mason being the newest Houston Texan. They immediately cut AJ Can. And now looking at the rest of this free agency so far, it started off on a high today and it really just let me down so far. Uh, the free agency missing out on a center as of now, missing out on a linebacker as of now. Al Shire is expected to go to the Titans. Jake Brendel re-signed with the Niners. Some of these contracts were rather mm, cheap, if you ask me, for what I thought Bradbury could have got re-signing with the Vikings. So those are a few guys that I thought the Texans, in those two positions specifically, center and linebacker, I thought that was something they should have gone after in free agency. They haven't done it yet. Things can change. I'm still, you know, we're still in free agency at the moment, so things can change. But right now, we are talking about Shaq Mason and how great of a pickup he is. Only allowed, I believe, one sack in all of 17 games last year. So that's an immediate upgrade. It's going to help out Tunsil. Should help out whatever rookie center now. You could be bringing in probably John Michael Schmitz. If you really want him, Luke Whipler, Ohio State. Uh, Joe Tipperman from Wisconsin. You got a few centers in there in this group that are not bad, and I am comfortable with playing them as a rookie, um, but playing alongside Kenyon Green, who did not have a good year, and having a rookie center next to him, I don't know how great that's going to be, rookie quarterback as well too, I don't know how great of a tandem that might be, but Laramie Tunsil still there for you as of right now. The offensive line looks like it could be an improvement going into next year. You got three solidified guys in Tunsil, Howard, and Shaq Mason now. Ricky Center, King and Green should show improvement this year. Don't throw him away just yet. He should show some improvement. Whole new offensive scheme, offensive line. I should see a lot of improvements from King and Green, and I am confident in his game. The Houston Texans made a splash trade, trading away just some slate round swaps, a six for a seven, but Shaq Mason is the biggest upgrade for this team. You should be definitely excited about what he's going to bring to the offensive line. As always, guys, go Astros, go Rockets, go Texans. You have a blessed day.